Hey everybody, you got the uh, garage guy here, and I got a phone call a little while ago from a neighbor telling me that they heard some chainsaws going earlier today down at my little shooting area. Now if you'd seen a video I'd posted uh, here about a week ago, where the storm had come through, and the uh, power company crews had to come through and cut some limbs down. Then you'll saw the mess they left. But anyhow, we're going to go down here and see what kind of cleanup job they did. Hopefully, they did a good job. We'll just have to see for ourselves here. But I tell you what, I'm going to be missing all this shade. And here we go. Well, looks like they got it cleaned up, but they just threw everything across the creek. Huh. Well, and this right here, straight in front of us, didn't even do a damn thing to it. Well, I guess I can work on that later. We're going to get out of the truck here and see what happened. picnic table now remember when I started the other video I started over here where my targets were you know the steel targets down to there where I shoot my little 22 rifles PVC frame and then I turned around and this ground right here was completely covered by trees. They did cut this one up a little bit here, but I can get to it easy enough. And yet, right up there's power lines. Huh. Let me see them. Yeah, they're up there somewhere. But like I was saying, remember, I walked through here and I was having to walk across the trees or whatever down through here. Well, they cleaned them up all right. But, you know, this ain't the end of the world. It could have been a lot worse. So I'm not going to complain any. I'll just bring a rake down here and all this stuff you see along the side. I'll just rake it over into the creek bed right in there. And when this creek starts running again this winter, it'll pretty much wash all that out. As far as these big chunks of wood here, it's been cut here in about a month. All this uh, leaves and stuff will be died out. And I'll go ahead with my chainsaw and cut out the bigger pieces and I can use them this fall for when I have bonfires actually they did a good cleanup job I do miss my shade though those damn power lines up there <laughs> well Sometimes you got to take the good with the bad, so they kept the word. They said they'd be back within three days, and sure enough, they was. Oh, well, I feel a lot better about this now. I'm just hoping some shade will hurry up and grow back here. As a matter of fact, this tree right here, They only cut it half down. You see all these limbs and stuff on it. 
I'd say by Labor Day, this thing will probably be about two or three foot taller. That'd be a little bit of shade, but you take what you can get. Well, like I said, they kept the word. They came back. They cleaned up their mess. And hopefully here within a few weeks, I'll be uh, doing some more gun reviews. I can come down here start shooting these targets again this is garage guy I'll catch y'all later